Hey guys, it's Friday, so we've just got back from shopping. We went tonight rather than yesterday because Danny was late home yesterday from work, which was unfortunate, but it meant that he came home early today. So we went shopping nice and early today. And also Danny wrote the meal plan for next week. So he's got jacket potato for Monday, Tuesday, Caribbean chicken, Wednesday, meatballs and pasta, Thursday, sweet and sour chicken, Friday, we're having wraps, Saturday he put down barbecue slash spag bowl. That just depends on the weather. We've had a couple of really glorious days and I think I think he's feeling a bit hopeful. And then Sunday is our typical Sunday roast. So let me spin you around and show you what I got and how much I spent. So tonight we spent a total of £86.99. And, and the first thing I got and the thing I'm most impressed with, I got some clematis. And these ones are the early sensation and they are an evergreen that's what they look like and I have been looking for this this certain one online and it was about 15 quid a plant and in Aldi's they are six quid they are 5.99 so I got three of them and I will I will have these in my secret garden area climbing up the trellis so I'm really really happy because I do have some other clematis plants but they're not evergreen so most of the year they look they look appalling but these and the leaves are like parsley so if you like plants, consider going to your Aldi's and picking this one up because this is a really, really nice plant. I love the white flowers, although they're, they're looking green as they're coming up, but they open white and an evergreen climber, which is fantastic. So I got three of them. I need to deduct that off of my, um, my receipt because uh, that's obviously not coming out of the food budget. As for other non-food items, I got some window and glass cleaner because I needed it. And I noticed that this says here cruelty free, which I'm quite impressed with. It's been awarded with the good housekeeping label. So I got that. I got some ironing water. Danny likes to put that in. It smells absolutely lovely. Makes the clothes smell really nice when you iron them. And two mouthwashes. And then as for fruits and veggies, I got some bacon potatoes for our jacket potatoes on Monday, some mushrooms, some garlic and some onions were part of their super six. We needed quite a bit of fruit so I got some, some bananas, some tangerines, some oranges, some grapes and some apples. Then I got some mixed peppers, cherry tomatoes, cucumber, some mixed leaf salad, two bags of the chicken breast fillets some cheese slices, the kids really like them in sandwiches, some mature white cheddar, some cheese sticks and some pepperami things for their pack up. Cameron goes back to school next week. He only got one week off this time round. Normally in the East holidays they get two, but he's got one. I got one of these. Last time I got the garlic and herb and this time I got the smoked salmon and dill and it's the soft cheese, the raw, and I think, I think that would be really, really tasty. I got my milk, some yogurts, some jelly. The kids wanted jelly, so I'm gonna make this tonight and then they can have it tomorrow. Some salami, some long grain rice, some frosted and some hoops, that's for the kids breakfast. And then Danny likes oats, um, so he's got some porridge oats for his breakfast. Two tins of tuna chunks, some cider for me, and some Guinness for Danny some tomato ketchup and some salad cream, plain flour. Danny also picked up some roller cola and two apple and blackcurrant squash for the boys. Some hazelnuts, coffee, pan of chocolate. We like these, really, really tasty. Two loaves of bread, some cheese bakes that the kids have already, already tucked into and also some monster claws, some crisps. So that is what I picked up at Aldi's today. So if we have a look at next week's Special Bias magazine, they've got lots of gardening things coming in. There's obviously a garden event. And like I said with those plants, Aldi are so good with their plants. I've bought a few plants with, from them over the years and they've been, been really good quality. That looks interesting, look at that. It's a, a pizza cooker to go on top of your barbecue. I bet Ollie would like that. P 
Pizza is Ollie's favourite food, isn't it, Ollie? Yeah. Isn't that lovely? And then they've got a water bath system. These are really good. I bought two a few years ago, but in green to to help with when I'm watering the the garden because you know when you've got to put the hose away every night, it's a right pain. Although I'm not sure about it being white. I'm not sure if it'll show the dirt. It, I mean, it looks lovely there, but I just wonder what it looked like after a couple of years. climbing plants there are some other clematises I have I think I have that one and that one that I got from there before but they're not evergreen but they are really really stunning and some power tools Danny always loves looking at the power tools and they're amazing meat offers and their super six fruit and veg. Oh, that looks interesting. I might have to stock up on some of these sets. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, bye.